Hey, it's Ask Dockage Time, which every day should be Ask Dockage Time, but today's Ask Dockage Time. Uh, the question comes in, good move by Larry Bird for firing Frank Vogel. My answer would be, look, I don't know if it's a good move or not. Time is going to tell, but Larry Bird needs to be held accountable for this as well. Think about this. Frank Vogel got a team into the playoffs that Larry Bird himself said only had two really good players, and that's Miles Turner, a 19-year-old that broke his hand during the course of the year, and Paul George, an obvious star who had uh, a horrific injury only a year ago. And now Paul George comes back, and we all think he's a star. But Frank Vogel took that team and took it into the playoffs and played the two seed down to the wire. Now, if Larry Bird only has two really good players on that team, that's on Larry Bird. Frank Vogel did really good things here. Frank, Frank Vogel did things in spite of management. Management never really helped Frank. I don't think that Frank Vogel was ever Larry Bird's guy. And it was illustrated today, Larry Bird was asked at the press conference, did you talk to Frank in person? He said, no. So we talked over the phone, and then he further threw Frank under the bus by saying, look, Frank begged for his job back, but I had almost made up my mind back at the All-Star break, but Frank deserved the opportunity. I think it's all crap by Larry Bird, but again, he has, if he's dissatisfied with the direction, if he's dissatisfied with the coaching of the offense, or he thinks the players aren't paying that much attention. He has every right to do it. So we'll see who he hires. But that guy better be damn good because Frank Vogel was terrific, not only on the court, but off the court and in the community here in Indianapolis.